I am Dr. Sark Hill, consultant psychiatrist at Living Mind. We do offer a range of services. We specialize in psychiatric consultation and we offer mindfulness and acupuncture as well as reflexology. My name is Malini. I'm a reflexologist and I uh, work for Living Mind. I do general reflexology, I do reflexology, lymph drainage, and we also provide reflexology for maternity and uh, infertility. I am also trained uh, for doing reflexology for cancer patients. I do have a lot of clients coming in for reflexology and I do a lot of lymph drainage for them because it helps with their immune system a lot. Reflexology is a therapeutic uh, for massage uh, where pressure using thumb and finger walking technique is applied on reflex points on hands or feet. These reflex points are set to correspond to different parts of the body thus providing beneficial effects and the different benefits of reflexology include improvement of your mood, it releases tension, it provides relaxation, improves sleep and increases your well-being. Acupuncture is one of the complementary therapies being increasingly used in Western medical practice. It involves piercing the skin with fine metal needles at specific points on our body. The technique is more than 2000 years old. We all know it is an integral part of traditional Chinese medicine. So how does it work? Is there any scientific evidence? Answer is yes, there is a good scientific evidence and with the knowledge of our anatomy and physiology within Western medical science, we now know that there are various mechanisms by which acupuncture can be extremely beneficial for physical health as well as mental health. It essentially stimulates nerve fibers in skin and muscles, increases local blood flow and thereby promotes local healing. Pain relief is one of the key beneficial effects and in fact it can reduce the pain throughout the body by activating an effect called extra segmental effect. It has got a calming effect and it improves general well-being which essentially makes the chronic pain more tolerable. So which conditions you might benefit from by having acupuncture? Chronic pain, acute pain like torticollis, tennis elbow, headache. There is increasing evidence of benefits in infertility from acupuncture. As a consultant psychiatrist, I am aware that acupuncture can be beneficial in anxiety disorders, panic attacks, depression, stress and OCD. At Living Mind, a registered medical practitioner delivers acupuncture. We are unique because we integrate acupuncture, mindfulness and reflexology as and when appropriate. I came to Living Mind um, for really reflexology for stress relief, um, for anxiety. Um, I get a lot of sciatica so to help with that um, that there's really nothing to worry about, there's no pain involved, it's really nice, it's really relaxing, um, you sort of go into a bit of a trance, it's, it's, it's lovely, so I would say they've got nothing to worry about and I would definitely recommend it. It's been permanent pain, I was taking Codidromol most days of the week just to help ease the pain. It was difficult to walk, so by the time I got to you, I was using a walking stick as well to help me. Uh, going on a car journey was uncomfortable and painful, and generally it wasn't very nice at all, the pain. It was so uncomfortable, but it was fine. It didn't hurt it at all, really. It helped to relax the muscles, and gradually it helped to ease the pain. So after the first session, I wasn't taking quite so much Kodidromol and then I had continuous sessions for a few weeks and each week I was taking less and less Kodidromol. We look forward to making lives meaningful.